This answer is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your Squarespace questions or tasks on demand. So I've set up this uh, grid. This is just uh, three by two rows. And let us try to see if we can add padding to the sides. So this section is called Ingredients Gallery. Let's copy the ID of the section. Begin with padding. Let's add padding to the sides. Let's go for 150, 150. So there you go, this adds padding to the sides of just this section with all of these images. And that's really as simple as it is to add padding to the sides. Uh, additionally, you can use margins if you wanted to. Say margin, you essentially copy the same code, let's disable our padding, and instead go for margin and you'd have the same effect on the images. That's how you can get them um, to not be full width off your, on your section, as you can see here. The next thing we wanna do is we wanna take this code and put it in side of Squarespace dashboard. So I'll use the padding instead and I'll copy this. Go here. Design, custom CSS. I'll just call this gallery. And save it. That should reflect in our templates. Mm -hmm. Okay, it seems that in our CSS margins may be better to use than padding. So we'll exit that out and save that instead. And there you go, now this section is not full width relative to the rest of the page. Was this helpful? Ask a Squarespace question now, askquesty.com.